Are you sick of those hand pruning saws? Or how about those pesky pruners? Well, we've got the thing for you. Sacred 4 inch mini chainsaw. Alright guys, in all seriousness, the folks at Saker had reached out to me and asked if I would do a review on their 4 inch mini chainsaw. So they sent me a smaller uh, packaging version than what you would normally get if you bought it from them or on Amazon. So in this package here, uh, we have the charger for the battery. We have the battery. Uh, one and a half amp hour um, I did charge this ahead of time before the review and it took uh, I'm not sure how charged it was when they sent it but it took a little over an hour to charge it all the way then it comes with a little screwdriver some uh, some oil I would imagine that's for the chain then we have uh, the little tool for the bar, and then the mini chainsaw itself, and of course the owner's manual. All right, initial thoughts on the uh, the balance and feel of this Saker mini chainsaw. Um, feels pretty well balanced in the hand it's not heavy at all um, there's a little button here that you need to push in order to run it I am right-handed but I could see how uh, being lefty that would be kind of screwy you'd have to do some some funky stuff like that but overall it's feels good in the hands it's got a nice rubberized uh, grip there uh, feels pretty well made let me see what it feels like with the battery in it with the battery in it it's still very very light well balanced let's see what she sounds like Not really too loud. I'm probably still safe to wear uh, some ear protection, but uh, overall, it's a. Uh, it seems to be a well-built uh, budget tool. I'll take the battery back off for this part. The instructions say that uh, the chain here should uh, only. Right in the middle of the bar, it should only move down about two or three centimeters. And that's about right on right there. Uh, this is a little brush card. Uh, seems like it's on there pretty good. Uh, yeah, I mean, overall, it seems like a, a, decent, a decent little tool. I would have liked to have seen, uh, you know, maybe a two amp hour battery. And uh, some sort of cradle to charge it but uh, this is what you get you plug it into the wall and you have this little thing that plugs in the top there is an LED that uh, goes bright green when it is fully charged and like I said when they sent it to me I'm not sure how charged it was but it took about an hour and 12 minutes to uh, to fully charge but when it comes to uh, loosening or tightening the chain Pretty much use this tool to, to loosen it up then uh, right in here there's a little screw that you can use to, uh, to to tighten it up another thing I like so far is that uh, we have another mini chainsaw that we purchased uh, a couple years ago um, the bar and chain oil reservoir seems to be an issue on these mini chainsaws, but uh, Saker has figured that out where you pretty much just need to lube the chain. 
and they give you a little bit of oil to get started with it uh, and it says in the manual that if you're cutting fruit trees to use vegetable oil because uh, mineral oil will um, will hurt your trees now we're not going to be cutting too many fruit trees today for the uh, at least not ones that I'm eating off of so uh, it says just to uh, lube it up and make sure you get enough to go down onto the bar too one other thing I just noticed as I was getting ready to put the battery in and start using it was this lanyard um, it's for safety I guess it's it's not long enough to get into the chain but I've got pretty big old paws so my hand barely fits into it but I guess once you get it on it's not too bad definitely not gonna drop that let's go see how she does I'm just gonna clean up some of these branches that are going to the inside Really is really nice. Definitely made quick work of that. Get a few more here. Wanna do an undercut? I'm just gonna kind of process this into uh, usable firewood. See how it does with uh, I'll just kind of process it. jumpy with the small stuff so you might want to use pruners for that but it seems to be really really good in that two to three inch range Definitely not very forgiving on smaller branches. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with it overall. Uh, you do have to be careful because it is a chainsaw. But uh, there will be a link in the description below, which is an affiliate link to Amazon to get this. Hope this review helps you make a decision. And thank you for watching.